Um, you know what they all do here? Everybody does different jobs yeah. here, or they did. So over the years, when we have people who come back from overseas, we try to meet them at the airport. We try to get a contingent of anyone that we can that knows that person, even if they don't know that person, to meet them at the airport. We're down there to welcome our brothers and sisters back. And it doesn't matter what time of day or night it is or what kind of weather it is. But with this virus, things are completely changed. So we were going to meet at the airport. That was our plan. But obviously, we had to change things up. And now we're here at her house. That's not going to stop us. One of our own, we love her. We're going to be there for her. When Kristen texted me the other day and says no one from the unit could go see her because she was being quarantined, me and a few girls got together and were like, oh, no, that's not acceptable. So we had planned on going to the airport and just stand in the parking lot with our signs and just let her and her family know that, you know, we wanted to show our appreciation for all the sacrifice they made. Um, and so then, of course, that got canceled. So she drove herself home from Baltimore because her plane got canceled. So. Just last night on the whim, somebody says, oh, we have all these signs. Why don't we just go to her house and show her our support? One at a time, keep the distance. And again, this is just isn't for Chris and it's for her family too because, um, you know, deployments are actually harder on the families because they're the ones, you know, home having to fill in all her duties as well as the fear of the unknown. You know, the military member, they're away, they're deployed, they're doing their mission, but the family's home not knowing what's going on. So it's harder on the family. So again, we wanted to show Kristen and her family our support. That'll, that'll yes. keep you going there yes. for a few days. Yes, I am definitely going to open that up. That was the coronavirus if you had it. I can't believe how big Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I think this is great. I thought we were going to have maybe three or four, but look, we've got people from all across. Uh, folks who are retired, folks who are still on in service right now, but they're all here. They're all showing their support and their love for one of our own. Look at what color she is. <laughs> Welcome home!